What is up, ladies and gentlemen of the Uverse? Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining us. And uh, today we're going to be addressing something that I was hoping I wasn't going to have to address, but it turns out I do. As some of you eagle-eyed viewers might have noticed in the last video, something's missing on the end here. Yeah, um, my CRG arrow had a little bit of an off. Empress is fine. Empress didn't go down for all of you guys that really care and uh, love this bike almost as much as I do. Um, she's fine. Literally the bar end adapter let loose and the arrow mirror fell down. Uh, fortunately it landed in the middle of a lane so it didn't get ran over but it did crack the glass and uh, scratched up the, the frame quite a bit. Um, CRG is absolutely awesome. Uh, emailed them on their website. They asked me to call them. I uh, had to call them a couple times, I'll be honest, but it was over the holidays, so you know, they were probably running on minimal staffing. Uh, got back to me and sent me out a brand new frame. Um, I thought I would just be getting the frame. It looks like this actually, I haven't opened it up and confirmed, but it looks like it's got the glass in it. Um, if you guys just break the glass, you can order just the glass replacement kit. Um, I will put a link for that down, down below because that's commercially available, same price everywhere. So it's an Amazon affiliate link. Thanks for the help. But hopefully it looks like we got just the glass. So email CRG if, if you've got any sort of scratches on your frame and let me, let me open this thing up because it's uh, pristine, absolutely gorgeous. And it really wasn't that much more expensive than just the glass, surprisingly enough. So you get a new little rubber, or not rubber. Um, oh, let's switch over to this camera. Let's see. I'll go up to this one for the video. Give it, give it just a minute. Here we go. Now she started up. Is she recording? She's recording. So, yeah. Open this up. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's the brand new one. You can see it's got the, the glass already in it. Looks like it got a little scratched up. So that might be something that they might want to address. Um, hopefully it'll just wipe right off because it just got scratched up by this plastic piece um, which replaces inside the arm. And then it also has a new O-ring. So we are going to replace those. Let me see, do I have a clean? See if we can get this sucker nice and clean. Because that's one of the things that I love about CRG is their optical clarity. And yeah, no, there's definitely a couple scratches and and stuff in there. So uh, yeah, CRG might want to work on their packaging of just this frame. Or just order the replacement glass. I'll show you how to do that here as well. It'll also be up here on this camera. Um, it's that cleaned up quite nicely, but it's still got some scratches and stuff on it and some smudges. So yeah. We will definitely rebuild it. I will replace that glass. Um, I will be using this. So that is your part number, the GK300, is your CRG Aero glass kit. Ooh, we get CRG uh, stickers in this one. More knifeage. That's pretty clean. Looks like there's even a couple smudges on that. You may not notice it, but may not come across in the video very well. But there's definitely smudges. Oh, yeah, they just 
cleaned right off. So, <laughs> I made it worse. There we go. Now we've got that beautiful CRG mirror finish on a mirror, go figure. All right, so there's the replacement glass that we will be using in the replacement glass kit. You also get a sticker and a selection of O-rings and a replacement screw. This screw goes right there. Parts you need are just a couple Allen keys. You need a two millimeter and a three millimeter. The two millimeter is for this one right here. I guess that was just held in by a couple screws. And now you can see where those bigger O-rings go. So there's one there, one there, one there. That one stuck to the glass. Right there. Replace that sucker. And those big O-rings go around there. Well, that big O-ring, it's doubled up. It looks like a single, but it's a double. Or it, it looks like a double, but it's a single. And that will just drop down in this frame. And this one's brand new. Normally they say, they recommend to replace them. Um, and I would have, if I was reusing this frame, definitely replace the O-ring because it's more than a couple years old. It's gonna be dry. So we'll just get it down in its little groove down there. See that right there? See how that O-ring, it actually has, oh, it's gonna be stubborn. So it has kind of a, a double kick to it. And you gotta get it down there in that little bump out, because otherwise it's holding the glass from seating all the way. And that's not good. That looks better. All right. Tip first. Now that's in nice. All right. So it's got a little lip right there. Just slide it in underneath the lip. Oh, this goes here. Put the screw back in and snug it up. Now we've got a nice well, it's a little dusty, but perfectly clear, non-scratched mirror in our brand new CRG Aero frame. Cool. So now we just address mounting it onto the arm, which is the three millimeter. Oh, I probably wanted to get, turn this so I can get to that other screw. That's just logical. So we got a rubber ball there. Get the white, that white plastic, where'd that go? There. Oh, I don't need that out. Duh, I'm using a whole new frame. So a ring in first and then the rubber or the, the rubber O ring in first then this plastic cup in. I will take this opportunity to wipe some bug guts off of this. High speed maneuvering will get some bug guts in some really weird places. Now that looks clean. Yeah. Brand new frame. 
old existing arm, two screws, three millimeter Allen. Now it looks like this has got a little bit of a pivot to it, so I'm not gonna cinch them, cinch one down without having the other one seated, just to, to prevent any pinching. And I think that O-ring prevents compression, gives it a little bit of a rubber shock. So when you cinch this down, it makes it so that it's kinda on that O-ring. And that, is how you rebuild a CRG arrow and make it brand new and beautiful again. All right guys, so uh, I will address why that fell off and how to correct it in the next video. So make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit that thumbs up button or the thumbs down button if you hated this and you don't wanna see any more content like this, go ahead and hit the thumbs down. I'm, I'm fine with that, it's, it's okay with me. Um, but until the next time, guys, keep that shiny side up. You know I love each and every one of you guys. See you out in the canyons. Peace.